The Switch Flipping Pro! They've done it! It's not called the Switch Pro, it's just called the Switch OLED model. The screen's bigger, it's got white Joy-Cons that hopefully don't drift, they're the exact same size, they look interchangeable. The Joy-Con grip has got slightly different grip, the dock is bigger, it's got rounded corners, it's white now. It's incredible, they just dropped the trailer. We've got LAN ports in there, inside of the game. It's incredible, the dock looks Wonderful. I mean, look at all of this. The dock is rounded on the corners. The kickstand is actually usable in most situations now. It's incredible. Oh my god. And why wasn't this at E3, Nintendo? Why didn't you put this at E3? Did the trailer take too long to make? Why didn't you make this its own thing? Why was this a, just a random Twitter release? And then we knew about it. It's incredible, the Joy-Cons are the same size as they'll fit even anyway, so they fixed the issue of what's happening with the Joy-Cons. The screen's OLED now, so you'll be able to see it outside, it looks bigger, it's brighter. The system might have better frame rates, they haven't told us yet, but oh my god, I need this. Guys, I have got so much to talk about, and I am freaking out, so let's flip out to the main angle, because we have so much to digest. Okay, so here's what we know. The Switch Pro dock has got more rounded corners and is bigger to fit the Switch, but it also seems from the images on the website to have ditched the standard USB completely moving straight to USB-C. At least the old USB port inside the dock has been replaced by USB-C, which I can see from the website on the American site, because Nintendo UK hasn't done flip for our website yet. As well as this, there's an Ethernet port built in, so you won't have to buy that USB thing that clogs up the port in the back anyway. And even then, there's more. The screen is bigger, so it... Do you remember that screenshot where it was the Switch, but there was the gaps in the borders, so it filled in where the bezel is. Well, now that's actually taken up by screen. The screen is so much bigger, so we are going to be able to play these games amazingly. And under the screen is the speakers this time, so we can hear the game way better. And it says the audio is enhanced. How much better the audio is, I don't know, but I'm really excited. It's not 4K. It specifically states on the website Enjoy HD gaming on your TV, which is an absolute bummer. But, even though it's not 4K, it should have better frame rates because it is the Switch Pro. It's called the OLED model. I was hoping for Mini LED, as I stated in my Switch Pro video before, but don't watch that, it's really bad. Um, yeah, the Switch Pro is amazing. It's got a variable stand that allows for just so much more adaptability and maybe actually of more use than having to just have a stand inside of your Switch case you carry it around in. Oh my god, Nintendo, what have you done? So this has had to prompt a few changes. You won't be seeing any more unboxing videos until the Switch Pro comes out because I really need to have money put away just completely. So, sorry, plans, you're on hold. The Switch Pro is coming and you guys know I am so goddamn hyped. The trailer is amazing, so I'm going to shut up and link you there. Go there, go watch it. Come back tomorrow for a new video that I was going to release today, but the Switch Flipping Pro. Guys, I will see you tomorrow. Goodbye.